as you guys could see from the title of the video and just everything in general i'm going to be giving myself a skunk stripe this is very 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 impulsive i do not know what is making me do this i just decided to do this just because i wanted to i think a skunk stripe would honestly be the cutest thing for me to do there's a mirror right here sorry i don't have y'all facing a mirror but like i can change that but yeah there's a mirror right there so i'll have to go do whoop -de -whoop over there i have all the stuff from sally so let me do a haul because i had to like get a consultation kind of with the girls that were there so they got me some shimmer lights to take the orange and stuff out of the hair gave me a little packet of ion bleach which i've actually never used before but whatever and then she also gave me a little thing of the 20 volume developer from ion so yeah she told me to mix it with shampoo so that's what i'm going to do but honestly i'm not going to waste any time we're going to hop right into this i usually part my hair a little bit like over but i want when i part my hair that some of this to fall right there like some of the blonde but then some people do it down here which i think is really really cute i'm gonna look at a tiktok hold on i have a i have a tiktok like saved that i liked how hers looked and the great thing about this is that i only have to dye this little bit of my hair okay and y'all i have this bummy ass t-shirt on because obviously i don't want to get anything on my clothes i'm just really really nervy it's literally hair and that's why i told my mom i was like if i do not like it i can just cover it back up with a brown dye and everything will be okay so it'll be perfectly fine i'm gonna show y'all what i'm doing so i'm taking a bowl so i do not feel like i need all of this bleach but i probably do because there's barely anything in this packet so let me show y'all okay i can barely show y'all okay so i'm gonna add a little bit of shampoo like the girl said i've honestly heard of people adding conditioner not shampoo so i don't know what she was talking about but whatever i mean she's the one that went to cosmetology school not moi so okay so then i have my little brush and you know i've watched enough brad mondo to know that you're only supposed to apply you should apply bleach to the ends um first and then apply to the roots last because the roots lighten the quickest okay but i think i got the bleach in a good enough consistency and watch this shit honestly not even come up how it's supposed to oh we're doing it it's burning my eyes is burning my eyes oh my gosh y'all it burns okay i have to hold this away from my face because the fumes are so extreme so i'm going to do my roots last obviously and then i'll be back once i do that but i'm gonna let this sit and like air everything out because i cannot breathe I cannot breathe in here. This is so, so bad. And it really, it's really making me cry. Like, I don't know what's going on, but yeah, I'm going to actually try to make a TikTok real quick. What I'm about to do is coat this in more bleach and then I'm going to go in and put it on um, the roots. Okay, so I know the lighting is different, but I just went ahead and put tinfoil on it. I know I look ridiculous right now, but it's okay. So I just went ahead and put tinfoil on it, and I'm in the process of making a TikTok. So you guys might see, you guys are going to see this TikTok before you see the video. I'm going to apply this to my roots whenever, I don't know, whenever I get the chance. But I'm going to leave this on for like this for like 10 minutes, and then add my roots or whatever. And just, I'm just going to have to keep my eye on it, honestly, because I don't want it to become too blonde. But then again, that might be really, really cute. So yeah. Anyways, we'll get, yeah. Mm hmm trying to make this as precise as i possibly can you are not supposed to rub this in your scalp and that's exactly what i'm doing right now and it is very very painful so yeah tell me why i put it on my edges y'all and i didn't even want it there now i'm about to start crying because i did not want it on there and i put it on my edges so i'm gonna have to wash that out real quick i'm trying to make sure that everything is evenly coated where it needs to be but i need to hurry up and wash this stuff out of my other edges so i don't know if you guys can tell but i can literally see a processing already it's basically blonde so i don't know how long i should leave this in for to be real with you i have no idea so i think i'm gonna wash it out at like 4 10 or something like leave it in for like 10 more minutes and when i wash it out i'll come back and like watch y'all y'all watch me style it i'm really really nervous because i've never really done anything like this before but we're gonna see what it looks like when i get back but i think it's gonna be cute especially with the roots the roots are gonna give but i washed out the part that i messed up so everything should be smooth but yeah guys so i'll be back when i am done with that so guys i washed it out and i have the purple shampoo in it um <laughs> I think it's giving what it was supposed to give. Um, we'll see once I slick my hair down and stuff. But y'all, the color, like I actually bleached it pretty, pretty evenly, which is so good. But I, oh my god. 
I already feel like this is gonna be the cutest thing I've ever done in my life. So I can't wait to slick it down. Obviously, I'll show y'all like me doing that on camera. So, sorry, my forehead is wet, but I just have the purple shampoo sitting in there so it can like take out the brassiness. I kind of look like I feel like I look like Corella Deville or something. But this is so cute, and I was really skeptical <laughs> of if I was gonna like this or not. But I really like it. But yeah, just for right now, we're just waiting for it to obviously the purple shampoo to take action so yes i'll be back once that happens i know i keep saying i'll be back i'll be back but uh, i'll be back but i if you guys like need help like figuring out how to do this please go to salaries and talk to somebody because they actually really really helped me so i'm really pleasantly surprised with how things turned out and they really did a good job so i cannot wait to see what this looks like when it's dry too i'm so excited so i'll be back once i start to like do everything okay okay Okay, so it is not it is not a completely 100% dry, but this is what it looks like, and it is a little bit orange, so I'll have to tone it again, but honestly, I don't feel like doing that right now. What we're going to do is we're actually going to slick my hair back, and I'm going to go get the eco and stuff, and I'm going to slick it back, and then I'm going to show you all the final product, but so far, I think it is really, 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 really cute, so I'm going to slick my hair back, and whoop -de -whoop, I'll be right back. It isn't that noticeable in like normal lighting, but I'm also going to see what it looks like outside. When I brush it back, it actually looks pretty cool. I want to dye this green eventually i don't know why but i just really really want to or like pink or something but this is one of the most spontaneous things that i've ever done i don't know why i did it but i don't really regret it the only thing is, is that it does fade to more of a brown back there which i did not want you can't really see it with the lighting in here like with all my studio lighting and stuff but that's okay y'all will see pictures on instagram and stuff and in the thumbnail but yeah guys i really hope you enjoyed this video i know this was random and super on a whim but I want my videos to be like a little more like less formal and more vlog style so that's kind of like me integrating into this but I still want to do hygiene videos and stuff but sometimes I just need to like make it a little more like casual and stuff so this is what it looks like I think it is super super cute but thank you so much for watching I love you all to the moon and back and I'm so grateful for every single one of you in the position that you guys put me in I love you guys so much thank you so much for watching please like comment and subscribe like I say in every video I love you guys so much and I'll catch you in the next one